And the streets of New York is an export of color. And uh, this song, as many of you know, indeed was recorded by the Wolf Tones back in 1981. It was a huge success at home in Ireland. And it pays tribute indeed to the Irish community uh, here in uh, New York. And the wonderful thing about this song is that uh, it's based on stories and uh, we told to the writer of the ballad, Lee Miley. And he was able to capture indeed the essence of so many, the motivation of so many young men and women who fill the ranks of the police force of the city of New York. And um, and I want to say that uh, it was a great privilege to sing this song everywhere in New York because it was recognition of the commitment that the Irish people had given uh, to the communities here in America. And sometimes that's gone unnoticed, undervalued, and undersung over generations. And the Irish people, when they landed in this land, when they came from Ireland, they found the liberties and freedoms that they had been denied in Ireland. And they were always forced, indeed, uh, to answer the call in the militia, the fire service, the police service. And it's a proud record. And this song was hard to convince many people that it wasn't about some of my friends and some of my personal friends that I've had lifelong friends in the, the NYPD. And they had two of them at the show yesterday, Dan Donahue and John Smith. But I'd like to dedicate it to the late and great Finbar de Hoyen, who is the leader of the NYPD Pipes and Bones for over 40 years. And those of you that knew him knew he was larger than life. And to his memory, the streets of New York Thank you. 